Welcome on in, everybody. Today, I thought I would do something... I'm not going to say much different, but one of the, my followers happened to comment in the chat. Oh, it's so hard to see. Lights or no lights, doesn't matter. Uh, that I perhaps haven't hit one of the bases being... I think it was the Omega Lab, which is going to be over here in the lily pads area. Because uh, I wasn't sure what I what I would need to do next to progress with the story and move on. Um, and so they commented and said that I should check out the Omega Labs in the lily pad area. And I was like, no, man. Like, I, I already checked it. Like, I've already seen all the labs. Apparently, I had not checked all of the labs. So we are actually headed over there now because I kind of looked up. I was like, Omega Lab? It's in the lily pads. Like... I, I don't know why I was thinking that the Mercury 2 was that coordinate on the map for some reason. I'm not sure why I just assumed that. I feel like I'm headed into territory that I don't really want to be in. What is this? I don't remember seeing this. What? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. That sounds not good. Oof. If I step out, am I gonna regret this? Nope. That's not what I want to do. Because I want to get a good look at what's around me. What is all of this? I just want to make sure there's not something extremely large and terrifying, which there always is, of course. I don't need that. Hey, 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 hey. Why you gotta be like that, bro? What we got? Apparently I already have that. Cool. Fabricator much Oh, I have that. Dope. I feel like this is something I should recognize, but I do not. Aquarium, I have that. Uh, I will always take a nutrients bar. Anything else? Anything else? Oh, that's kind of scared me a little bit. No? Okay. Oh, yes. I don't really want to scan that. I'm good. Prawn suit. Okay. So, yeah, pretty much I was like, no way. I've, I totally already checked that out. And then I was like looking at it and I even looked up a picture of it on Google Images, because I was like, no way, I already have that. Uh, definitely turns out that I don't, because I just looked at the picture of the actual base, and I was like, oh, that's underwater. No, I totally don't have that. While I'm thinking about it, I'm actually probably going to go ahead... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where was it? I think it was this. That was supposed to be, like, really close by it. Or at least that, that's what I thought. I thought it. I thought that was it. So, hopefully, I don't see anything big and scary. Can head over to the lily pads area. Okay. I didn't realize that before either. just dropped off down there. Very nice. But we're going to try to check out and see if we can find the Omega base. Was that there before? Do I remember seeing that before the alien tech? Surely. Surely I remember that. You're a jerk. 
Don't like you. Do I remember seeing all of that technology? I don't know. I don't know if I do. I love the whales. They're so cool. This very much reminds me of, like, the floating islands. Oh! Hello! I swear I did not look up the location for this, by the way. I swear I didn't just go like, oh, well, all I gotta do is follow that alien thing. I did not, I did not realize that at all. This was purely on accident. I was just like, I didn't see that before. I'm just an idiot. I guess I'll follow that and see where it leads. Swim charge fin. See, I have a bit of a problem with that. Because I feel like... I feel like those, they weren't that great before, because you're so slow with them. Hello. Anything in here? I could take a med kit. Altera. Vending machines. Who? Uh, uh, Danny's not here, I'm afraid. Uh, that's okay. It's you I wanted to see. What's that you're working on? Just a sketch for a piece I want to make. I'm slacking off. Don't tell the boss lady. <laughs> I won't. It's beautiful. What is it? I'm doing a series inspired by bacteria. Mutant beauty. Life, death, risk. You know, that kind of thing. What's this one? It looks like Harab, but... Vin, is this a mutation? It's just an art project. You know you're doing that thing with your neck, like when you're trying to bluff an alien intruder. <sighs> right, oh. fine. Fine. I'm bad at lying. Are you mutating Kara bacterium from the frozen Leviathan here in this lab? Please don't ask me any more questions. I don't think I need to. Ooh, all sounds bad. I don't know what this is. Aromatherapy lamp. I would like to have that one. Thank you. I challenged your spy pengling to a foot race earlier. Because you got tired of losing to me? Ouch. <laughs> what if I've been letting you win so I could see you smile? Cute. But I don't believe it. There are easier ways to make someone smile. Easier than losing a foot race? Oh, I think you're a woman with many talents. What are you implying? The artwork that appeared in my lab the other day? Oh, that. A study in Parhelion Red. I assume you had something to do with that. That depends. Do you like it? It's beautiful. Like the person who gave it to me. If I didn't know better, I'd say you were flirting with me. Do you know better? I don't know what I know anymore. Not when you're looking at me like that. Ooh. Getting cozy in the cone. That's a yeah. You don't need to know. That's a that's a reference. Okay. I mean, I'm sure I didn't really need to speculate that much before this, because I think we had one other correspondence between them that kind of let us know what was going on. Oh, let's let's see. No, I'm gonna put it over here. Picture of Daniel, framed art. art. That wasn't a picture of Dan Daniela. Or Danielle? Daniela? Either way. Alright. Oof. The key to total un. Okay, the key to total under uninterrupted focus on what's important is the ability to unfocus on the unimportant. The ultimate goal of concentration is not to block out the surrounding environments, but to maintain total focus in spite of them. They will be there. You must not be only better than them, but decopable from them. 
I don't understand why all of them. Is this important? It surely doesn't feel important. Am I freezing right now? Wait, why? Investigation notes. Omega Lab was first breached by heavy impact. Perhaps from a sea track modified with some sort of battering implement. A localized explosive charge was then released and detonated from a distance. Lab equipment was damaged to the point of inoperability, and all live specimens were destroyed. No personnel was injured. Samples have been collected for analysis to determine whether any bacteria escaped. It is, however, unlikely. The heat of the charge should have boiled everything within a 10 meter radius. Wow. That sounds bad. What is that? Can I scan anything in here? Could I fix this wiring box, by the way? No. I don't think I would need to, but I'm just curious. We've studied the first Kara bacteria samples from the specimen. Results are promising. We were able to stimulate rapid multiplication of cells in a controlled environment, resulting in the creation of several different mutations with potentially useful applications. Think of the possibilities. Life-saving treatments, genetic research. It could be a window to understand the evolution of life on this planet. The findings could move us forward by years. We recommend a wider study using samples collected from a greater variety of sites around the original postules. We trust you will provide the necessary security to do so. The Leviathan site must be protected. Uh-huh. Where's the Leviathan site, by the way? You know, I don't think you mentioned it, but I just thought I'd ask if you would know, you know. Wider study using samples collected from the greater variety of sites around the original postal. We trust you will provide the necessary security to do so. The Leviathan site must be protected. Uh huh. I hear what you're saying. However, I think it's a terrible idea. I think y'all crazy. And. I think there's got to be more here. There's lights headed that way. Because they would put the like top secret base, right? What is... Where's this light coming from, by the way? Is that just my sea truck? Wow, I have great light. I trust they wouldn't put the base that far from the specimen that they were attempting to, I don't know, use. Make sure I got everything out of here really quick. Otherwise, my sister will be more than happy to tell me that I've missed something yet again. Let's see. I don't think I need anything else in here. I think I've scanned about everything that I need to and or want to. Can I scan you? I would love to make some medkits. Okay. I think we're going to take the prawn suit and go on a little bit of an adventure. Because I, I would... I don't think that they would put it that far away. Well, Captain. Thank you. So there's lights leading off this way. Strong current right now. Lights leading off this way. There's alien tech leading that way. This might just these these lights might just be a way to be in like, hey, over here, dummy. It's right here. Um, but surely the thing can't be that far away, right? It's, 
Yes. Okay. So I decided I would try to go back to Marguerite's base. See if she has anything else to say. Since I'm literally right here and I saw like the, the environment for her base. So I was like, eh, maybe she's got something else to say. She does have that other room. She wouldn't really let me in, so... again. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it's me again. Okay. Just not gonna say anything. Oh. New technology acquired. Don't, um, uh, don't mind if I, uh, do. Marguerite. Wow. Glass table. Fancy. Wait, what's that? Is that a battery? Can I take that battery? Can I? No? Okay. I mean, I'm not gonna steal all her stuff, you know? Why would I do that? That's just... It's just rude. God, your place is a mess. What am I scanning? A small stove. I don't know why I, on earth I would need that, but... Uh... I guess I'll, uh, scan it, I guess. Hey, Marguerite, do you ever clean? Damn. A fortnight into our voyage, I was more or less living inside the creature's ribcage. It meant shelter, and it meant food. The flesh was starting to rot. The stench was unlike anything I'd ever smelled. As we floated, the temperature dropped, and the rotten meat began to stiffen and freeze. Slowly, almost imperceptibly, the Reaper began to lose buoyancy. We sank a little each day. My sanctuary was becoming my tomb, and I was at the mercy of the current and the winds. Until one day, I saw a smattering of penguins in the distance. Swimming birds usually mean solid land of some kind. I was lucky. The winds followed their path. Hours later, I saw a blessed sight. An unmoving cloud sitting upon the water. Land. It renewed my spirit as I watched the land get closer and closer. The reaper slowly sank, but I was no longer worried. When the Reaper finally sank below the water, I was close enough to lazily swim my way to shore. I made a note to come back for the Reaper's skull. I didn't ride the beast for three weeks to have no proof. Land never felt so good, even in this Arctic hell. Very nice. I don't know how you got it all the way down here, but color me impressed. Got anything else to say? No? Cool. You know, I didn't think you'd have anything else to say anyway. It's totally fine. Perimeter defense. That's gonna be really nice. I didn't know I could make a shower. Soap not included. Low powered con conduit conduction unit. A sink. I need a pipe. I've never made a pipe in my life. Alternatively, you could just go in the ocean. Ooh, yeah. Really good. Nice. Yeah. I mean, I guess all the fish do it. You know? It's not that bad, right? What else did I find? I can now make the perimeter defense, which is great, and the charge fence, which is uh, also great. So this is not entirely pointless, I guess, but... Fairly, fairly fun. Can I, can I get in, can I get inside your, it looks so huge. Look how big this thing is. Guess I'll leave it alone. Welcome aboard, Captain. Well, I hate to go much further down from here. I think that was the thought last time too. Even though I don't think there's much, yeah, there's not much down here. It's just, 
the vents, I guess. So I found Omega Station. Let's look back here. Uh, so I, I found the Omega Station over here. And alternatively, who was it? Sam. That's her messages. Oh, yeah. Notice of death, blah, blah, blah. Mementos, miscellaneous. News. Don't need that. To do's. I'm just trying to find any clues I might need for where this Leviathan is. I'm not really sure where I'm going to be finding it. Like, apparently it was preserved in some way, which makes me believe that it's... I think they even might have said it, that he's completely frozen in ice. So, let's see. I say he. So it means this thing's completely frozen in ice classified. Found that. Found the mining site. Outpost zero. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I've been to both of these. I've been to the island. I've been to the mining site and now I've been to the Omega station. I didn't realize also that in this little picture it had the phase gate in here. Didn't realize that's what that was. Totally honest. Ooh, yep. I happened to see that when I was going through this stuff. Uh, investigator. Great. That gave me a lot of information. Biochemist. Cool. Okay, cool. Did I miss something? What else is in here? Oh, this is the postcard. I miss you a lot, and I can't wait for both of our assignments to be over. Delta-6 has been an amazing opportunity. I never tire of watching the sunrise and sunset over the black sands of the Chirazain Desert. It's beautiful. The only way that it could be better is if you were here. Loving you across the stars, Irene. Ari Ariane. So that's the postcard. I keep dancing about around where this place is going to be and then no one actually tells me where it is. Unless they've told me and I'm a massive idiot, which is in, in all honesty extremely possible. This looks terrible. I don't know if I'm ready for that yet. <laughs> Mostly because I don't know where that actually goes, and I haven't seen it with it. Will you grab? Nope. Oh yeah, so I'm gonna see you guys back at the sea truck, I guess, if I find anything interesting. And I'll see you sooner. So I decided, while we're down here, I might as well Go ahead and get your titanium. I do not need titanium. Might as well go ahead and get these. Oh, that's what I I think that's it right there. Yep. I need a bunch of you guys. I will take all of you I can. How big are you in my inventory? Apparently small. Okay, great. Go ahead and scan it. There's nothing... Hopefully. Mm -hmm. Dangerous that I found down here the first time, so. I didn't realize I wasn't going to have to go that far. I just, right here. Wow, I have so many of you guys. This place is both creepy and amazing. Let's put all of the titanium in there. And we'll put a bunch of you guys. Cool. I don't actually know how many of those I'm going to need, but I want to 
eliminate having to come all the way back down here to grab more if I need them, so I'm just gonna pick up a, a ton. I want a bunch of these guys. I should have brought my sea truck as well. Because then I could grab even more. But I honestly think I'm gonna have plenty if I just fill up my inventory pretty well. Yeah. I don't I don't think it's gonna be any issues. This place is super cool though. Whoop. Overshadowed a little bit. Oh, you're full. <laughs> right. Oh well. Well, I guess I just keep it. Well, captain. Yeah, because I need that in order to make the hydraulic acid. And in order to make the polynyline, I need hydraulic acid. And I need three of these to make a hydraulic acid. So I wanted to go ahead and grab a literal ton of them if I possibly could. I don't think there's anything else down here I would need, right? You guys would you guys would tell me, right? You'd let me know that I need to keep going. That I should not have filled my entire inventory with these giant flowers. Nah, you, you guys would have told me, right? You're, I'm fine. Everything's fine. It's all fine. And I'm gonna run out of thruster. Right there. Cool. Okay, so yeah, I'm not real sure where else I need to go. I guess I'm just gonna explore around. I know I would like to get the modules for the sleeper for the for the sea truck, because I happen to find one I don't remember where at all. I could probably look it up in one of my videos, but I'm lazy, so not gonna do that. But I would like to do that, and then we have the like really scary place with that creature I don't know the name of or what it does or how bad it will just murder me, prong suit or not. I'm hoping it won't just be able to outright murder me. Because even with- oh, I thought I was higher than that. Even with the- thought I heard something. <laughs> even with like the Reaper Leviathan or- or any of them really, like they couldn't just one hit the prawn suit. Now they could do a ton of damage and you know, make it seem like I was in a tin can getting beat up pretty good. But it wasn't like a boulder to a to a tin can. It wasn't like instant death or something crazy like that. So I'm assuming that's that's the same type of situation here where this giant thing won't be able to just one-shot me in a prawn suit and make me look like a stone versus the tin can type situation. I'm assuming... I'm hoping not in vain. I am assuming that will be the case. That it's not a one-hit wonder worth of damage. I'm sure that we will find out. But... Unfortunately, I think it's going to have to be sooner rather than later because I don't really know where else to go besides in a very scary area that I don't really want to be in, but that's where I'm going to be going. That's probably fine, right? I should probably drink some more water. Man, I'm getting thirsty. I should make that suit. All right, let me fix my sea truck really quick before we get on the road. As people decide that they like, think it's yummy for some reason, not sure why. <laughs> Look at the map. Am I like skirting around? Because eventually I will get to the edge of the map if I keep doing this. You know, I'm just gonna say we don't. I'm gonna say we don't. You can all let me know that I'm babies in the comments below. Or you can let me know that I definitely should have kept going because that's where I want to be. Um, either way, it's kind of scary. Kind of don't want to be in here right now. It got quiet. There was no signs of life, which is not where I want to be. Uh, oop, I think I just murdered that fish hardcore. Okay, did not make it out. 
yeah, I don't like going somewhere where there's no signs of life because that means either something is killing all signs of life, whether it be another creature um, or whether it be an environment that is hostile to most living life, which, you know, in case anyone didn't know, I'm a a living thing. I'm alive, Uh, which means it's probably hostile to me as well. And uh, we don't want that. You know, it's not not something we want. And at this point, I'm just rambling on because I have absolutely no idea what to do or where we're going and eventually I'm going to cut myself off and edit a 30 minutes of talking out and you guys will be saved the trauma of listening to my voice ramble while I drive around the ocean looking at nothing for 30 minutes maybe what did Altera use this place for? researchers here were trying to find me Oh, so I just get that random dialogue. Okay. Well, I wasn't planning on uh, picking back up right here, but uh, so I came back to try to see if anything would happen or if I missed anything, because um, I happened to find the opening for this area. So I was like, I'll just go back in. I'll take another look for it for anything. Um, I wish I could crouch. I just sneak my way in there. I don't feel like I forgot anything here, but I just wanted to double check. I wanted to verify. And apparently there was some dialogue that I got from Alan, because I was I don't think I had Alan when I came in here the first time. I scanned all of this, I think. She was here with the scientist lady. Cause they got put in like in here together, I think. I don't want to close the door. Oof. Great. But I got Alan this time, so maybe he'll say something different about this. Will he be able to open this door for me? I don't know if- it wouldn't open before, right? Did I just need to come back this whole time? God, please tell me that's the case. I'm an idiot. I totally forgot about this place. What is this place? It is architect technology. Standard for my people. Well, nothing that your people do is standard to me. What is it? This facility provides the means for rapid travel. It seems to be inactive. Without a vessel of my own, this site is not of any great utility. I see. Huh. Without a vessel of your own. Why is that? I can travel through these. Does he know that? Does he know that I'm I'm good to travel? I do it. I have frequent flyer miles miles at this point. Maybe not Robin specifically, but Okay. Nothing else. That's all I get. All right, cool. Thanks, bro. I guess. I was really hoping for a little bit more than that. So I'm kind of just checking out some old areas here. Ooh, that was a hard hit. Didn't expect it to do that. Uh, no, I'm gonna... Do I go this way? No, I'm gonna go this way. I'm just checking out some old areas, seeing if I miss anything, seeing if now that I have Alan, he'll say anything different, or if he'll have any uh, dialogue to add. Because I have no idea what to do next. Okay, this was the robotics lab, I think. So we're just going to check this out and see what happens. Because I know I went in there. I have the phase gate in there, I think. Yeah. Can I take this in there? Because what I want to do 
is take the snow fox and travel around over here with the snow pangling. I don't actually have the snow pangling, but I could go back and get that if I really needed to. Ooh, hello. Um, I bet it's back here. I wonder if any of this hail could like do actual damage to me. It'd be interesting. But while I was out here, I didn't really have a whole lot. I also didn't know there was some like resources I could use. Hello. So I just kind of want to check it out a bit. There were stairs over there. I think we've been over there before though. Unless that's the way I need to go. We'll find out soon enough, I'm sure. I just wanted to see if there was anything I missed. And the snow fox is going to be a really great way to travel around a bit faster than just running around everywhere. I will always take food. Fiber mesh. Make water if I need to. That's great. I could have sworn I'd been over here. Because I'd been over here with all the trees, right? This is going to get tight. I don't think I can be. Let's just pack that up. Can't go wrong with some magnetite. What? Whoa, 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 hold on. Parvin? I thought he was with the mining site. Mining site security. No way. I'm a, I just want to check. see what else is here. Please tell me, God, please tell me this is it. Okay, I'm gonna go check out, I'm gonna go check out his office. Or, I'm assuming that's his office. It's got his name on it. I haven't seen his dwellings anywhere else, so we're gonna go check that out first. Oh, please, Lord, let me know that this is it. Strange place for a security bunker. Wow. Alright. What is that? Like a wormhole or something? If you're not cheating, then you won't mind if I record this conversation. Is that right? I have nothing to hide. Then what were you whispering about with Vin? Nothing. Th that guy is so lawful good, it's annoying. Wait, so you were trying to cheat? But no cheating occurred, so what does it matter? It matters to team morale. If you can cheat in the game, how can they trust you out there? I'm sorry, did you feel left out? Perhaps you would like to make a deal. Ugh, Parvin, no. You're shameless. You really never give up, do you? I don't. It's true. <laughs> Have a manual put that in my next eval. Very persistent. Uh-huh. My dearest Adeline and Rosina. Ugh, my dearest. Who says that anymore? Adeline, Rosina. Everything on the mission is going very well. Do you see now? Your doubts were unfounded. I am loved here, and... Oh, no. Rosita will say, Papa, why do you have to brag all the time? Papa, it's embarrassing. I want to apologize. Okay, no, that's taking things too far. I know we didn't leave things on the best note, but I want you to know I love you and I miss you. What happened here? Oh. I 
I apologize. No, I was gonna send you a message saying how everything. Uh, okay, I love you and I miss you. I don't know why I say the things I say sometimes. They just come out. I was going to send you a message saying how great everything is here and how everyone loves me. I've had a promotion to a very important security dozer. I'm treated like a hero, but really, this is a cold, wet planet. The scientists are full of themselves. There's no action to speak of. The only thing I look forward to is a weekly is weekly games of alien intruder. But more than that, I'm coming of coming home to you. I'm sorry for all the times I did not appreciate you of our family or the good life we had. And I, who am I kidding? I can't send this. What's the use? I think you should have sent that, buddy. Good. Ooh. This place does not look like it went well. What? What am I looking at? Okay, I'm just gonna... I guess now I have a second scanner. This was Sam's necklace. She never took it off. Huh. My investigation of the fire excavation site, including the cave entrance and surrounding area, revealed minor cosmetic damage to Altera survey equipment and significant structural damage to the natural cave entrance and supports. Resulting debris prevents cave access without heavy excavation equipment. Only foot access is currently possible. We are reporting two casualties, Pavan Ivanov and Samantha Ayu. Both bodies were found beneath the rubble at the cave entrance. Ivanov had just entered the cave. The prints were still visible by the entrance. Deeper into the cave, Ayu appeared to have sustained a fall. Poor souls. What was Ayu doing? Nothing in her file suggests a history of vandalism or carelessness. And yet, I can only conclude that the cause of the collapse was employee negligence. Oh, we will need to investigate a possible connection to the explosive damage reported at Omega Lab. If there is a connection, who is responsible? It appears that your sister's death was accompanied by significant destruction. Doesn't make any sense. She would never destroy a base. Well, baselessly. Are your feelings confused? I'm detecting more than one. I don't know. I, I feel... Disillusioned? Worried? I thought I knew Sam better than I really did. When we were kids, I was always the one breaking and rebuilding things. She wouldn't even go into a bake sale without a plan. For classic oatmeal cookies, no less. So serious. She wouldn't have anything to do with my molecularly transformed caramel pretzel lumps. Your mind goes easily to food. To distract you from your feelings. Okay, I think that's enough mind reading for now. This wasn't negligence. That's not Sam. This was something else. Huh. Patrol log, excavation site, day 33, morning. I thought I saw something moving on the screen, but it was just that I sneezed, wiped it off. Fred's not convinced the Leviathan is really dead, but I've never even seen it blink. Nevertheless, I am now undertaking the mandatory foot patrol. Inside the cave, confirming a whole lot of nothing. Creature still dead, cave still boring. I miss the mining site. At least you could talk to people. Oh, wait now, what's this? A rock! I found an interesting rock. That makes three this week. The others will be happy to have a friend. Concluding patrol. Perimeter secured. Nothing to report. End log. Activate elevator. Do I want to go up? Let me see what else I got. I'll pick up some glass. 
Oh, what happened to you, little buddy? Oh, you just gave me... I don't need that. I'll always take an advanced wiring kit. Do I need water or anything? No. A necklace that belongs to Sam. I don't need to bind it to anything. I don't really use these things. And I got plenty of water. I'll just drop those right there. Maybe I can come back for it if I drink water. <laughs> Either way, this thing looks terrifying. Should we go up or down? I kind of want to go up. Oh my gosh, look at that thing. Just look at- wow. Inventory full mine, but drop that. Drop that. I will always take some synthetic fibers. Ho 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 ho. Hi there, can I scan you? Oh. Oof. Okay, let's read about you a little bit. Lots of room for a brain, but it's mostly bone and fat. Where is this at? What am I reading right now? Okay. Sharp teeth for tearing through flesh and bone. Good to know. Because mm -hmm. that's always what I wanted to know. Stand by. Insert sample requires injectable container to function. What? what does that mean? Dude, you're so creepy. Oh. I'm not convinced you're dead either. I don't really want to get closer. Mm. It makes me so uncomfortable. I guess I scanned the Kara virus that's on you too, huh? Environmental conditions and subtle, subtle mutations suggest that the, this variant of the Kara bacterium rate of transmission is somewhat lower than that of the widespread outbreak previously reported on 4546B. The bacteria capis, capacity to survive for a long period of time off the Leviathan's corpse suggests highly effective saprophytic properties. Scans indicate that the Pustules are merely the visible components of a dense bacterial network feeding off the dead cells of the Leviathan, despite the risk further research is recommended. Ugh. Oh, that's just fall to my death right there. Alright, well I guess we go under now. <laughs> Ugh. I don't want to be that close to him. It makes me nervous. Big dude like that. Breaking a giant piece of ice like that's that that's already kind of carved out. I don't think it'd be that much of a problem for him. I really don't. Oof. It gives me shivers. This dude is enormous. These guys are dead, right? I just had that thought. This there's not more of these, right? Oof. And I'm sorry I like pause every time I was like talking to stuff. I don't want to progress and cut off the like the dialogue if there if there happens to be dialogue that comes up. I will absolutely take hydrochloric acid. What I don't really want to drop the posters. They were really cool looking. Oh, uh, I guess I could drop the glass. It's not a big deal. Oof. Look at this thing, look at that! Jesus! It's a beast right there. We found this thing bur buried, buried, buried in the glacier. Gave someone a hell of a fright. Turns out it was walking around a thousand years ago when it fell through the ice. It was infected with the Kara bacterium, the aggressive disease which wiped out the architects and almost, almost life on the planet. It is 
unclear whether the mutated Kara pustules presented an it presented are responsible for the ultimate demise of the creature. Since the enzyme cure was released on 4546B, the bacterium has been all but eliminated. Rare specimens like these provide provide our only light lives live source. Living source, live source, our only live source. Research on the bacterium has been transferred to secure Omega Laboratory Laboratory while further research on the creature will be conducted at the excavation site. Oh, at the excavation site, huh? I've been there. Why would you start digging this guy out? That just gives him more room to move. Okay. Aren't you supposed to crouch? Spelunky crouches for me. Okay, well, you do you. Look at this thing. Look at this hand. Jeez. You could just sideswipe me. So. Oh, look at this guy. Screenshot. Right before he busts out and murders me. Okay, I've gotten everything, right? There's nothing else. I didn't miss any PDAs. I didn't miss any anything else. Oh yeah, my inventory is full. That's fine. I got food and water. That's a pretty cool shot too. It's just enormous. Wow. Gives me shivers. Okay. So. It says that it looked like she's disdained to fall. I want to go back to that. Altera. More like alien cheater. Let's see. Delivery station meeting personal favors flirting <laughs> gone fishing greetings family I think it was this one let's oh, my was... investigation of the fire excavation site including the cave entrance and surrounding area revealed minor cosmetic damage to Altera survey equipment and significant structural damage to the natural cave entrance and supports. Resulting debris prevents cave access without heavy excavation equipment. Only foot access is currently possible. We are reporting two casualties, Pavan Ivanov and Samantha Ayu. Both bodies were found mm. beneath the rubble at the cave entrance. Ivanov had just entered the cave. Footprints were still visible by the entrance. Deeper into the cave, Ayu appeared to have sustained a fall. Poor souls. What was Ayu doing? Nothing in her file suggests a history of vandalism or carelessness. And yet, I can only conclude that the cause of the collapse was employee negligence. We will need to investigate a possible connection to the explosive damage reported at Omega Lab. If there is a connection, who is responsible? Huh. I mean, we know. It was Marguerite. We know exactly who it was. Did I check this out over here? I think I've like, missed it. I've missed so much stuff. I mean, because that was Marguerite. She took care of that. And then Sam was supposed to come over here. I did miss this. Oh my gosh. I don't need a flare. I don't need that. I mean, I, I could take a first aid kit. I'm not going to say no. It'd be helpful if I could see anything, too. Oh god, that scared me. I don't know what it was, but that scared me. 
What's, what you got? What you got? New technology acquired. Jump module? Heck, I'll take that. Dangerous so weather approaching. Seek shelter. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Guess we're gonna keep going up this way. So, it sounds like Parvin. Parvo? Parvin? Parvin? I didn't know that was his name. I, it sounds like he was like trying to stop Sam. Maybe. Right? That's kind of what it sounds like, right? I'm trying to just follow the lights at this point. That doesn't sound good. I think I've cornered myself. What? Come on, Robin. Okay, fine then. Can I go up there with a the snow fox? Oh. You know, I don't think I want to be here. Sorry, didn't mean to interrupt family time. And I'm out. Oh, wonderful. We're just gonna peace out. Okay. Oh, Jesus. So yeah, it sounds like he was maybe trying to like stop her and they got into maybe a scuffle? I don't know, That that's just a guess. Oh, shoot. Oh. I almost did it right there, didn't I? I almost just went right off the edge. Yeah, it sounds like they got into like a scuffle or something and then maybe you set off some stuff. I don't have a spy penguin right now. A spangling. But then she was setting off explosives, right? That's what she was doing. Just like uh, Marguerite was, a ladder down. Let's see what else we got. It's that tingling noise in my ear. There's a ladder down. It's like impossible to see right now. Like they did such a good job with this weather system. Go down. So I'm just trying to get back to my back to my truck at this point. Can I go that way. Let's try this way. This looks promising, I think. Maybe. <laughs> Can I make this with my soapbox? Oh, I made it. <laughs> Everyone surprised? So am I. So she was trying to blow it up, right? She was trying to blow it up, and maybe he, because he's the security presence there. He like saw her on the cameras and he's like, hey, what are you doing? She probably didn't know that he was stationed there. It, it just doesn't make a lot of sense. Maybe, maybe Marguerite might have some more information for us on that. Unfortunately, that will have to wait till next time. Thank you everybody so much for watching. And thank you for joining me on this incredible adventure of trying to find out what to do next or even find the freaking Leviathan in the first place. <laughs> I'm sorry that it took me so long. I didn't realize it was going to be back here at the Fire Robotics Center. I guess I should have realized that because it said that it was frozen in ice. It's just going to be next to one of the bases so that way they can study it. So that way they can get samples readily to it. So it, it makes sense now, but 
thank you everybody so much for joining me on this adventure. If you have any suggestions on what I should do next or any ideas or tips or like nudges in the right direction, I would greatly appreciate that because I don't want this to kind of go stale and me just to walk around and be like, oh, I guess I'm going to build a, a truck module today. I, I really want to progress in the story a little bit and I don't, ooh, I, I have a fear everyone's just going to say that it's time to go deep down in a dark place. Anyway. <laughs> I'm going to mull that over for a little bit. I will catch you guys in the next video. Catch you guys later.